Good morning guys, happy Sunday. I uh, hope you're doing well. I feel like I've been awake for hours, but it's because I have. Ruben very kindly woke the house. Is he awake again? I think he's staring. Ruben woke up at 20 past five. So we all got up. We watched this thing on Netflix with its fat elves and reindeers that he likes. Well, he likes the music, he dances. Uh, he was back in bed for half eight. John and I drank coffee and yeah, Ruben's awake, hang on. Did you have a nice nap? Look at his hair. <laughs> I think he might be getting curls. So yeah, Ruben went down for a nap at half eight. John and I drank coffee. I've had the longest shower that I've had in a very long time. Um, we did consider going back to bed, but actually just enjoyed drinking coffee and chatting rubbish and as I say I had the world's longest shower. Um, John's out sorting the car out. I'm dressed. I was just about to pack Ruben's bag but he has woken up from his nap. So shall we get dressed? Yeah? Oh such a cute face. Okay need to get Ruben dressed. Are you gonna smile? No, no smiles. Hello. Hi. Uh, yeah. Oh, there's a horse box. That one with the flashy light looks like a horse box, doesn't it? So, made it in the car. Um, we are heading to Costa, not Starbucks for a change. Um, it's close, going to the range very kind company called On That Day have gifted us a um, print of the sunrise of the morning that Ruben was born. Um, this isn't sponsored or ad or anything like that because they've gifted it to me for Instagram purposes, not YouTube purposes, um, but it was given to us for free. Um, so we're going to go and pick up a frame so I can take a picture for the, uh, the old Instagram, but Costa is right next to the range, so I'm gonna go and check out. And like, it's that debate. I personally prefer Starbucks coffee, but I prefer Costa snacks. Just my honest self. My hair at the moment looks like a right bob. It actually looks quite nice there. Maybe it's time for a trim. No. No, because I hate it the moment it's done. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy New Year. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas. We wish you a Merry Christmas and a Happy successful trip to the range That's all right, isn't it? it was very busy but you know it's that time of year where people are buying presents and um, buying Christmas decorations to put them up like amount of people buying trees yeah. it was a bit a little That's bit nice stuff though didn't they? they did I think sometimes sometimes it's tacky the range gets a bit of a bad rep no I just think sometimes some of the stuff is tacky mm. but then some people like tacky Christmas don't they or yeah. do you mean everything in general? No, it's a bit, like, do you mean a bit live, laugh, love? Yeah. Live, is it? Yeah. <laughs> it's down to individual taste though, isn't it? It's whatever you like. But um, yeah, we went in for frame and we might have spent 20 quid on gonks. Yeah, well, them gonks were cool, weren't they? Oh, we could have spent more. You know, if... If, if our house was bigger, I reckon we'd have had 50 quid's worth. Yeah, they had some really nice proper big ones. 
but I just don't know where I'd put them. And I just have this image of Ruben walking around with them, <laughs> which still could that, happen. That big one was quite heavy though. I don't yeah. Think he made it then again though, no, he was. He's so strong. Uh, so yeah, so successful. 50 quid spent. Um, now off to find somewhere for a bit of lunch. Okay, so, oh, my makeup. We've been home for about an hour and a half, so we went to the car, went to the pub, had Carvery. We've been slept the entire time we were there. <sighs> These are not cold sores. When I'm ill, my lips split. I'm feeling better, so these have got a heel now, but they're like, ugh, sore. Um, yeah, we went to the pub, had carvery, Ruben slept the entire time we were there, which was nice. Uh, we've been home for about an hour and a half, Ruben had lunch. Um, John's been doing this. We're going to get a new TV next year. Ruben's at the stage where he keeps on trying to climb and grab the telly. Um, the plan is to get a new, we were going to buy a new TV before Christmas, but there's a big fear of Ruben breaking the said TV. So we bought a stand as a trial, because the wall can't take the weight. Well, it probably could, but if we're buying a new TV, I don't know. Might quite fancy one of those sky glasses that are quite new. But we've not made our mind up yet. Um, so we're doing this until Ruben gets out of the let's try and smash the TV stage. Um, but it looks a bit messy. But it's just done it, literally, apparently it's meant to take an hour and John threw it up in 20 minutes. So, tidy it up after bedtime, I think. But yeah, I'm just gonna make a coffee and I probably should take this eye makeup off because that looks atrocious. Okay, so I've not taken my makeup off yet. I'm gonna do Ruben's tea and put him to bed, but this is the picture. I'm gonna to have to flip you around because of Ruben's light that we have to go to the range for today. Um, I love it. I really actually like the frame. It wasn't what I wanted, but this is better. So I'm gonna turn you around and hopefully the light doesn't interrupt. You can see properly. Okay, I have to do it at this angle, otherwise you get to see Ruben's lampshade, but that is the sunrise. Um, the morning Reuben was born um, and it was, it's over a beach in St Ives where John and I got married and I love it. Um, at some point I need some natural light to uh, get a picture for Instagram so that's not happening today as it's already pitch black outside at four o'clock or five o'clock. Um, but yeah, I love it and let me say it's the sun rising on a new beach 28th of August 2020 because Reuben was born before the sunrise. But yeah, I absolutely love it. And it's 20 plus 7. The toys are put away. The makeup has been taken off. Last night's Christmas jumper is back on. Ruben is in bed. We had a very um, in-depth Duplo session. <sighs> Ruben quite likes to hand you the different bits. He wants you to build and then gets to a desired height and then he takes it apart. He's clearly made for upper management, micro uh, micromanaging his team and then ripping it apart. <laughs> uh, yeah. Right, time to put some tea in, make a brew, maybe pick a movie. I really fancy Bridget Jones's diary but might be a bit chick flick for John, I'll see. She's gone to get somebody out of the car. I'll uh, see what he fancies when he gets back in. And it's tea time, and tonight it is shop-bought pizzas. These are Sainsbury's. Uh, John's got a meat feast. I've got a ham and mushroom with garlic spinach. I had some cooked bacon to use up in the fridge, so that's been added. And some cheese, and I've put some herbs on mine. On a little bit over, but it'll be fine. Fine. Almost forgot to end the vlog. Um, it is bedtime. I'm in bed. Um, I've got clothes on. <sighs> we watched Love. No, we watched Bridget Jones' Diary, and then we watched Friday Nights last week. Um, 
packed Ruben's bag for the morning, so he's all ready to go. John's uniform is unironed, still drying in front of the heater, um, and I'm working from home tomorrow, so nice top, pyjama bottoms is all I require. But yeah, that is the end of our weekend. Hope you have enjoyed the vlog. Hope you've had a lovely day whenever it is you're seeing this. And I'll talk to you in the next one. Bye guys.